Hey, how's it going? Uh, Christmas Eve Eve, 23rd December. Um, still checking traps, not having any luck. Had a couple of raccoons wander in last night, but they missed the steal. They're still hitting the bait though. And we got one more warm night coming before it gets back into the deep freeze. I should be ice fishing real soon and I'll do some videos on that. But right now we're getting food ready for uh, Christmas Day, so let me give you a look at that. So my trapping partner for this week, say hello. Hello. Yeah. What did we have this morning? We had oatmeal. Well, no, I mean, what did we have on the trap line? Well, we had raccoons coming in and out of the bait pen, but none of them hit the. None of them set the trap off. And now, what was the tracks you saw high of the bait pen when you were going up to pull that cage? I saw coyote jacks. Sweet. Well, we might still have some luck. Anyways, this is my project for the day. Cheap $20 cast iron grinder. It works great. I've had it for 10 years. And I'm grinding up some goose breast. Canadian geese. I had a friend give me a shout. He said, hey, you want some Canadian geese? I said, yeah, sure. How many? He said, six. I said, sweet. I don't know why he doesn't eat them. It's a waste of some really good dark meat. But I'm going to do up some uh, garlic meatballs in a cream sauce for uh, Christmas Day. So there's your traditional Christmas goose. Thanks. You never ever waste the stuff that doesn't grind. You always pull it out and you always use it. <laughs> but you're very careful to watch for steel shot. So here we go. We got the goose meat cut with a little bit of fatty beef just to to give it some fat because that stuff is pretty lean. Cut with some egg, um, some cornmeal, some spices. Ground those garlic cloves right into it. Some zucchini muffins. We're going to have those. We're going to rock out to some of those later. But I'll show you the final product. This is why you have to be careful. This is after grinding it after mixing different meats, after handling it multiple times, that little bastard was in the bottom of the bowl. Oh well, I'm going to make sure I warn my guests. Price of eating healthy. Alright, so here we go, final product. There we are. There we are. Goose meatballs. Good stuff. Thanks for watching.